also use the interval bisection method and that, that's not the topic that we're going to do later. And I have no idea how to do it. Um, so, <laughs> I'll do, uh, let's, uh, let's do this then. So, you probably have to start to find the next value. So, it, it has given us that x0 is 2, so it's the starting point. Now, as you can see in the function, to find x new, we need the, the differentiation of the function. So, let's differentiate that first. So, for, uh, the differentiation of f of x is essentially just 2x and that's it that's how that's the differentiation so this is probably what we have to do first with Newton Raphson is to find a differentiation and that's why we did differentiation on Thursday if no no one knew why we're doing it it was not just because differentiation makes the world go round does it, does it though does it really <coughs> yep Deep words here from Nathan. Yep. Yep. I think I am Constantine is also uh, Gandhi nukes. Fucking Gandhi nukes. I don't know, they, they just sound to be the Do same. not mention that name to me again. <laughs> he is my enemy. He will die. Okay, I'm gonna save this stream. I'm gonna save this before I lose it. Okay, so, yeah, so now let's find the next value of x. So, let's put this in iteration. So, with something, you have something like a table, and you have an iteration, and then you'll start from zero, and it'll go like one, two, whatever. Um, so, yeah, so you'll have that table. It'll probably be a better table after some time, but yeah. So, you put x old, which is the first value you get. So x old on that side and then you put the function of x old because you need that value as well and then the differentiation of f x old so you can find the new value to test. So I'm just making some weird table here. Doesn't matter. It should look better on your exam paper, I believe. Really? I wonder why. <coughs> Probably because mm -hmm. you're not writing with a mouse. Um, so you get x new from there, using that formula over there. And then I'm going to put f x new because we're asked to stop as soon as we reach that value there. Oh, what's this? Dan's spelling us. Okay. With <laughs> taken quotes. So, I'm just going to do the first three iterations on this table, and then I'm going to use Excel to get to generate the, the last value. Um, so, yeah, the first iteration will start with a 2. And I'm actually going to use Excel to do all the, all the calculations because, yeah, it's easy. Um, x old and then x new and then the function of x new. So this will be 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. You probably don't even have to put the iteration part, but, you know, just it's a good thing to have. Um, so yeah, now the function for f of x old is so x squared, so this will be x times this and then minus 5, that's how to find fx old. So we would get minus 1 first and then the differentiation is 2x, so it will be 2 times the value that we get for x and then x new is the Newton Raphson method, so it will be x old minus the function of f x old divided by the differentiation. So we we'll get 2.25. Now, 
FX new is the same as that, as that so I'm just gonna copy that and then just change the values around so it will be F and F so yeah now every time you generate a new value of the X new you will put it where X old is so the new value of X old and that's pretty much it so I'm gonna fill out the table now so this will be 1, this will be 4, this will be 2.25, and that one will be 0 0.0625. So is this less than that? No. So you continue. How many zeros is that? Anyways, that's five zeros. So 10. We're trying to find something that's less than this. So less than the, that. That's what we're trying to find. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Yeah, 6 actually. So yeah, as soon as we get that, that kind of value, we can stop. So I'm just going to do this because Excel does it for me. So simple stuff. Cool. And now I can just drag it down. And as you can see, I already reached a very low value there. And that's probably where we should stop because that one is. Um, I'm busy. <laughs> <laughs> um, so you would. Uh, we would wait still a bit. Um, we're gonna have to have a break now. Yeah. Okay, it's Sarah. Oh, geez. Why is that broken? I'm, I'm gonna mute the mic on the stream. Okay. <laughs> they can all hear me still, right? I'm broken. <laughs> oh, fuck. Bless your face then. Ta-da! <laughs> Exponential. You just write it. Okay, I'm back. For for a bit, I gotta go in. Uh, I gotta go for like five minutes in a bit. And then I'll be back, so I need to order the food. Okay. Um, so yeah, the table, I'm just, you know what, I'm just going to copy and paste the table from Excel. But as you can see, we already reached a very low level, that gives me a zero for the function, so it must be that. Because it even repeats itself, so... As you yeah, can but see, when you write it on a calculator, it would be much clearer. With number. Uh, who are you numbers. talking to? Uh, just general. So, okay, so it basically, essentially, uh, okay, essentially, this is the answer for the root. So the root. The root is 2.2366a. So it, the thing is, if you if you're doing iterations and you get the repeated value afterwards, then it must be that value because you cannot go further down. Uh, well, you could if we had a supercomputer, I guess, but <laughs> that's it. So you'll just start there. So what's the meaning of the root you just found? The root's positive. Yeah, the, the root is positive. I think that's all we can say. What else can we say? That's it. I think. It would be good to get a, a short answer like this and not one with a lot of iterations. Because that would. But, yeah. yeah. We're not going to. Well, it's fine. No, it says minus. Mm.
I'm just saying like, yeah, you could stop there. But if you're not sure, just do the next iteration. Because that is pretty small. That is 0 0.0000000000. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 1, 8, 6. So, yeah, that would be pretty small. That is that is smaller than 0 0.00001. So, that's where you stop. And that is your value of x. I don't know why, but I have the urge to ban I am Constantine. Go for it. Yes. Okay. No. Maybe they'll actually spell the name correctly. I want to know what they are, though. I want to know what love is. Yo. <sighs> it's like, Carlos, don't let it feed, like, don't let it get to you, man. It's like Gandhi nukes got to me. And yeah, doesn't it sound like it. Okay, so we've done Newton Raphson. Was that right? Do I need to do anything yeah. else for Newton Raphson? I'm pretty sure this is it's one of the easiest ones. But the thing is, you gotta remember the formula because we're not given that formula in the exam. We're given the second method formula, and I guess you could work it out from there but yeah you just gotta remember it's x old minus the function of x old divided by differentiation of x old <laughs> or if you wanna get technical and no not physical but if you wanna get technical Ooh. I can give you the technical formula and I just call it text I can give you a technical formula um, yeah, the technical formula for the Newton Raphson, if you don't like the x new and x old terms, I prefer it. This is the technical formula, and this is what you have to essentially remember. It's the same thing, it just says that the iteration is more, it's another, it's the second, uh, it's the iteration that comes afterwards, basically. <coughs> okay. I need to go for a bit and then come back. So shall we have a break? Let's have a break. Should I put my stream up? I think I should put my stream up. No, no, no don't worry. I've got a stream. I've got. I've got I mean, I've got a break. No. We can put um, a Skype on so we can. Yeah, yeah. I got a text yeah. from my sister. See the zoo. So. What what? Yeah, I'm gonna go. Just turn the stream off for a bit, and then we'll be back. No, it's because then we we'll break it down into videos. Well, I guess, yeah. Man. Uh, so if you're not subscribed, subscribe now on Twitch, so you get an email when we come back. Yeah. But the thing is, I'm going to have a break afterwards anyways. To eat. What? Are we? Gonna, yeah, I'm going to have to eat. <laughs> Remember? I'm going to have uh, to, like... Yeah. I'm gonna have to ask oh, for the, the food. food, and then the food will probably take like 30 minutes. Yeah, so we can do the second method, and then you can break, and then we'll come back and do the rest. No, we. Yeah, I can do the second method as soon as I finish. Okay, so I'm gonna be right back for like five minutes, five minutes, five minutes, and then I'll come back, and then when my food comes, we have to break. Okay. Okay. Does that sound cool? Bye. Bye. Bye, guys. No, no, I'm gonna have to break. You can, guys can still speak. <laughs> I'm just gonna mute my mic, and you guys can speak to the to the audience. <coughs> I don't like the audience. They all suck, but <laughs> this is this is going well, isn't it? Go order your food, goddammit. Have you actually stopped now? No, no, I'm gonna put transition up. Okay. Why don't you just leave Sam? Yeah, I'll do it, it's fine.